It's glorious Goodwood and it is right now, but for how long I wouldn't be so sure. The wind is getting stronger. The sky looks like rain is about to fall. And if it does, that would just match the, the forecast or many of the forecasts have been indicating a wet and windy day. The opening day here of this fantastic five day meeting, a meeting that has as its day one centerpiece, the Cata Goodwood Cup, in which we again get to lord the talents of the Sports Supreme stayer Stradivarius. He has been unbeatable in the last two years. One of his victories here last year was in the Goodwood Cup. It took him to the Weatherby's Hamilton £1 million bonus, completed that, that, that time at York. And again, if he goes from here to York, victorious, a £1 million cheque will be handed out to Connections. His principal rivals this time include the second and fourth from the Gold Cup, DXB and Cross Counter. Well, we've also got three interesting three-year-olds headed by Dashing Willoughby taking him on. But Stradivarius for the star duo of Frankie Dottori and John Gosden, the undoubted headline act in the Goodwood Cup. The chief principal supporting contests are the Vintage Stakes and the Lennox Stakes. The Vintage Stakes is deep. It's a really good race this year. It includes the 1-2 from the Chesham Stakes, Pinatubo and Lope E. Fernandez, and also the Superlative Stakes winner, Mystery Power. And yet it's such a good race, the winner might come from something outside of that trio. The Lennox Stakes has the last two winners of the race, Breton Rocks and Sedan Slot, and also the first four from last year's race, headed by that David Ellsworth trained seven furlong specialist. The card opens the typically competitive Goodwood Handicap, the Chesterfield Cup, as was seven races on the card in total. Stradivarius, as I say, the headline act, but the big story away from the racing could well be the weather. Weather, it's getting windy already.